It's not often that a movie star decides to take a role on a soap opera, but that's what James Franco is doing. He grew up in Palo Alto and is still close to his mom. That connection is why he's taken a temporary gig on General Hospital, seen here on ABC7 every afternoon. Here's arts and entertainment reporter Don Sanchez. Welcome to franco -frenia. James Franco as the character Franco. The actor's been acclaimed for milk, as a stoner in Pineapple Express. This summer, he stars with Julia Roberts in Eat, Pray, Love. In General Hospital, he has a unique co-star. I love you, Mom. Oh, I love you too, Bobby. That's Betsy Franco, James' real-life mom. We'd be saying things to each other that we would never say in real life. <laughs> Big deal, sure, but it felt strange, she says. Betsy Franco and her husband still live in the Palo Alto house where James and his brothers grew up. She's written more than 80 children's books, like Math Matickles. It's math problems with words instead of numbers. She encourages young people to use their creativity. Betsy not only writes, she acts in improv classes and sketch comedy. Two of her sons are actors, one is an artist. Tom, my artist, illustrated Metamorphosis. And James and Dave read the audiobook. Home has always been an artistic environment. So we encouraged it. We always had materials around that they could work with. James was inspired by watching her write books. He could see a model of somebody who was, who was making a living doing something creative. James is not just an actor. He's an artist with a one-man show. And he's going for a Ph.D. at Yale. He's just always been extremely curious, very focused, interested in everything. Betsy's always encouraged her kids to use their imagination, but she says they inspired her to broaden her horizons. My sons are fearlessly creative, and they made me see that there was no, what can you lose? Her GH role will finish, but Betsy Franco isn't done yet, for sure. Franco who? In Palo Alto, Don Sanchez, ABC7 News.